in a room that looks like a classroom. A very beautiful girl with a tall body and bright yellow hair was seen standing looking back. It is known that at that time the girl saw a flash of ice which was quite cold. However, when he turned around, he was shocked. And suddenly his body froze, showing a shocked expression. Then, on the other side in a room in the hospital, a girl was seen in intensive care, from his mouth using an oxygen device, and right beside him there was a man who was waiting for him. Then, after that, he sat next to her while stroking her hair. She said that she always liked him when he went against her when she was giving him advice. However, now she didn't even react to what he did to her. And it's not very interesting at all. However, it is known that at that time, the man stated that he had hidden something from her. Then he stated that he was not the only one in his family who had awakened his abilities. And then a blue light began to shine above the head of a girl who was lying in the bedroom. And at that time, the man said, that his ability is stealing. He can steal from others the abilities they have. But after that, a blue ball formed above the girl's head. He has a D-rank ability, and the name of this ability is a mental explosion, which can send a mental blast to attack the enemy. And even though his abilities at this time are still weak, but this ability of his sister had a special meaning. And if the ability is stronger, then Fei Fei will not turn into an ice statue instantly with an attack that is considered an accidental attack. However, if you think about it again, was it not on purpose? Because if you look again, the distance from Fei Fei is very far. And then his thoughts were interrupted by a scream from outside. And at that moment, someone shouted very loudly. He said someone in there was a murderer. And then someone else's voice came from inside. He said, but didn't he save more people? After all, he couldn't possibly control everything at once. Coincidentally, Miss Yong, namely Fei Fei, was just at the shop and she added that they didn't want this to happen either. But heroes are not gods. They have tried their best to fight monsters. Sometimes they can accidentally hurt other people while fighting monsters. These words were spoken by a man in a business suit. And in front of them, who were standing at that time, were the child's parents. Next. Fei Fei's father shouted that he would not sign these documents and told her to take the money. And immediately he threw everything on the floor. However, what surprised the lawyer was that the brother came and immediately took the documents. And he stated that Fei Fei was in a vegetative state and they needed money to provide everything she needed. But after that, his father was surprised by his words. However, he realized that he was right. He had no choice but to keep quiet. Then after that, the man hugged his wife's shoulder. And then the man turned to the lawyer and said that he had additional conditions. He wanted the hero who hurt his sister to apologize to him. The lawyer was a little confused and said that he could apologize to her. And he added that the Kunlun company should also make an official apology. But the man said that he wanted the hero to personally apologize to his sister. However, it was discovered that he was too busy fighting and he would not be able to come here in person. And he added that they were ready to pay 100,000 more as compensation. Then the man grinned and handed the documents to the lawyer. He says that he has signed it. Then the lawyer thanked him for that. Then after leaving the hospital, he called his client and said that he would solve everything, but only need to add another 100,000 as compensation. On the other hand, a young man sitting in the shade said that 100,000 was not that much. And after that, he will tell his secretary to send the money. Then, after the conversation is over. The man smiled slyly, and at the same time, he also asked if. Maybe it would be fun if he could awaken his abilities. Then, after that, on the other side. At this time, the man was talking to Fei Fei, who was currently still unconscious. She tells him not to blame her for signing the contract, after all the situation in their family is not very good at the moment. But he added that he should not worry. He will find out the truth because he doesn't believe it. All of this is unintentional. Some awakenings are not worthy of being called heroes, and they will change this world. Then, after that, it was stated that the young man was named Yang Shi. He is an intern reporter and the person who was accidentally harmed by Hunter was his sister, Fei Fei. Currently, he was walking in the city carrying a large suitcase, 
and to implement his plans. He moved out of his parents' residence and came to another district, namely, a district called Ming Yue. It is known that there are many high rise buildings there. Sometime later, Yang Shi entered an apartment, where inside there were already two girls who were seen waiting for him. Then one of the girls with blonde hair and the other with purple hair greeted him and said that they were his neighbors. The blonde is called Ding Lan, and the other girl is Xiao Ai. There was another girl with them, but she hadn't come yet. Then after that, the blonde jokingly asked him whether they can celebrate his presence. However, Ding Lan said that the third year exams were about to start, and he had to visit the library. And Ding Lan told the two of them to do it without him. But after that, Yang Shi turned around and went to his room. He says that this is not necessary. After all, he had also just arrived and was a little tired, so he wanted to rest. The girls were a little confused by the cold. Then after that, he entered her room, and she immediately fell on the bed while taking and looking at her phone. At that time, he said, and on his cell phone, he saw a hero where they were fighting a monster. And it has become very popular because there are so many videos with explanations about its capabilities. Then he saw a black hole in the sky from his cell phone. He doesn't think he remembers exactly when it started, but dark portals suddenly started appearing all over the world, and monsters arrived through this portal to their planet. However, it is known that only hunters can stop these monsters from attacking them. And at that time, these hunters were given the title of heroes. To prevent hunters from abusing their abilities, there is a regulation that regulates the law of abilities. It is only made by hunters who have passed the exam and have received a hero certificate who can also use this ability. Then, after that, Yang Shi stated that this was the video where Fei Fei was injured by the hero. But currently, he hasn't found anything suspicious. Tomorrow, he has to study this video again. But after that, when he had been playing with his cell phone for too long, he realized that at that time the time on his phone showed 2.30. Then after that, when the man walked down the corridor holding toothpaste, he saw a beautiful and sexy girl standing near the bathroom. It is known that at that time he was drunk. The girl leaned against the wall and barely stood on her feet. By that look, it could be understood that he was drunk. Then, he thought he looked like his last neighbor. And when the girl barely opened her eyes, Yang Shi greeted her. However, he immediately vomited. And the girl rushed to the bathroom and said that she felt bad. And if he doesn't mind, then he will be the first to use the restroom. And after that, he bent over the toilet and started vomiting. While the man just watched her fall asleep in the bathroom while shaking his shoulders slightly. He asked if he was okay. But he didn't respond to his words. Yang Shi wondered if he should help him in his opinion, wasn't very close to a girl in such a state, and he decided to ask for help from other neighbors and knocked on the door of one of them. Ding Lan came out yawning and asked what happened and why he hadn't slept even though it was so late. Yang Shi apologized and said that the girl next door was in the toilet and she was drunk, and she said would they help her because she is a woman and it is somehow unacceptable for a man like him to help her with this. However, he said to leave it there because it's not the first time and he has to go to work tomorrow morning. Then after that, he said good night, and after that he closed the door. Then after that, Yang Shi had no choice but to help him. Then he approached the girl he asked if she could get up. But she was still unconscious and didn't react to his words. He smiled awkwardly. He said that he apologized earlier and picked her up and laid her on the sofa. But then a sign appeared in front of him where it was written that the ability to reboot the brain was discovered. Yang Shi was surprised that this girl had an F-rank ability. The title Brain Reboot, the description said it puts the brain in a reboot state for a short time, significantly increasing the brain's computing ability. Assessment is good potential. It seems like the owner doesn't know that she has this ability. You think that this girl probably thinks that she is very smart. If he studied well, he could be the best. But using his abilities, he took his abilities away from the girl, said that in the future. However, somehow about to cry because of his ability to grin, he wondered what effect this would have on him. A sign appeared in front of Yang Shi, on which there was a question that brain reboot and mental attack both referred to mental abilities. Does he want to combine them? Then at this time, 
Yang Shi was holding the two balls, where the balls are blue and red. Then, with the skills in his hands, he combined the two. The ball was combined into one with a large orange ball. Now this ability is D+. Superbrain title rating description is that it automatically sends mental attacks a significant increase in the ability to calculate and reduce devaluation. And it is a double-edged sword, and it must be used wisely. The man evaluated his abilities and thought that maybe he could find some clues in the video about the incident where Fei Fei was injured. Afterwards, in the morning, while he was sleeping, someone knocked on his room and yawned. He went to the door, opened it, asked who was knocking. There was the girl Yang Shi helped yesterday. He thanked her for her help and gave her his coat and introduced herself. Her name was Lin Nai Shui. Men think that this girl looks very innocent. After taking his coat, he said that he was just helping her and also introduced himself. And then he remembered that he had taken away his ability last night. Even though she didn't even know she had the ability and asked if she felt well to which the girl replied that everything was fine and she was used to it adding that there was no need to worry about her. But then, a man came out of another room tall and furious. When he saw Yang Shi's eyes, he was happy to say that he was also the one who lived here. But when he saw a girl next to him, he was very surprised, and immediately exclaimed that he had met someone behind his back. But he said that it was just his neighbor who lives with him. The guy was just stunned. I looked at them and thought it seemed like he was acting too impulsively. When she rented an entire apartment because it wasn't very profitable, immediately straightened her hair. He greeted the girl by introducing himself. His name was Fan Peng and friend and colleague Jan. They shook hands in greeting. And then the man said that he had the ability, the ability was the ability to take pictures and record videos with his bare hands. So if he wants to take some beautiful photos, he can contact him. But then Yang Shi interrupted him by saying that Fan Peng came to take him to the editorial office as if he was on a trip with her, and they had to immediately move the picture to the computer where there was a video where Fei Fei suffered the hero attacking the monster. Yang Shi activated his deduction ability and started watching closely. While he was watching the video, he noticed that the hero was making strange movements that were very suspicious. But then his friend came pushing his shoulder and cheerfully asked, why was he not interested in flirting with girls, especially with such a beautiful girl? The problem, and he adds, if he won't do it, what will he do himself? Yang Shikoli says that they are just neighbors and asks him not to overdo it. The laughing man said that going from roommate to bedmate was very easy and said he could teach. He, if he didn't know how, and then someone shouted that a monster appeared looking through the window, they saw a one-eyed killer monster. He looked like an octopus, only several times bigger and scarier. Then after that, you can see the monster starting to attack. Someone reported that it was a B-level disaster and asked to go to the nearest shelter. As the heroes were on their way, and the monster destroyed everything in its path on its way. And then a hero appeared wearing special camouflage. Then after that, he proudly said it was the hero Spicy Noodles, and he would not let anything happen to the city of Lugats. All the residents were happy to say that he was a hero in the rankings. A spicy noodle superman he came to save them watching this fan Peng said that the one-eyed killer not only has a strong defense, but he also has psychopathic melee abilities. And 18 spiders working together would be very difficult to overcome, and the sour spicy hero might not win at all looking for another way he didn't find his friend, and noticed that Yang Shi was running fast grinning. The man says that common man is so weak as to make special cans with his hands. He can make a camera screen and say it's time to make money with his abilities. And then the hero joins the hero with the rank of fire butterfly. And he asks if he needs help. The hero says that he is just in time. He will restrain him and let him attack when they are not fighting. All this is recorded. Live. In front of the camera, two more men are sitting. One of them is Director G, and the other name is Mal Hua. The director said that sour spicy hero is a melee hero. He is selfish and narcissistic when he first appears. Mao Huang asks the director why he gave him such a review. The same replies that to activate his ability, he needs to eat a bowl of spicy noodles, so he usually appears after the other heroes have finished the monster and killed it. Val Huang smiled and said that as expected of Director Ji, 
He always leaks information that others don't know. The director coughed awkwardly and said to stop talking and continue watching the live broadcast of the battle. The hero hits the monster on the heroine girl's head, telling her to move aside, and with the help of his abilities. He hits the monster, and because of the power of its ability, the monster starts burning someone in the studio, saying that this monster's life will end soon. But the director rejected this information, to which Mel Wong asked, surprised, why he thought so. Director G replies that monsters are also smart. He has never seen a single sign of anxiety in these monsters. And then the monster appeared in front of the heroes without any damage. The hero said that this monster had evolved, and now its body had a fireproof shield that the girl asked about. Whether he could still hold on much longer, it would be a while before the other heroes arrived. And then he remembered the conversation of a man sitting in a dark office, telling him that he was already entering the narrowest point in his career. A professional hero. If he wanted to break through and become one of the most famous stars in the company, then he couldn't allow any more losses. Once he fails, his weakness will diminish and the company will direct its resources to younger heroes. And then he thinks that he might lose his senior position in the company. And he can't let this happen at this moment. Yang Shi came down and saw that this hero you swallowed some kind of pill. Yang Shi realized with shock that it was the blue pill her hero's girlfriend who was caught by the monster with its tentacles. He screamed and asked for help to be saved. Then from a live broadcast, they showed how the heroine was caught by a monster with its tentacles and all the comments written to someone to save the heroine. And sour, spicy hero can only last for 15 minutes. When the monster brought the girl closer to its mouth, then someone pierced its tentacles. And it was the sour, spicy hero who snatched the girl he was aiming at seeing this Mao Huang was happy that the superhero could stay in battle form for more than 15 minutes. And this time, he broke through stronger than before. Director G said that it was very unexpected, and they wanted to add something. But Mao Huang interrupted. He told him that the monster attacked our hero. The monster with its tentacles started to attack the hero, but he was able to break through by activating his power. This sharp blow turned the monster's body into a mess. But then the effect of the blue pill gave the opposite side effect. He fell to the ground, coughing blood, when the heroine girl wanted to help him. He saw in front of him how the hero's face turned blue, and it was scary to see this. He gets scared and also sits down and asks what happened to him, the hero. In turn, he thinks that he has to control all this. And holding back with all his might, he smiled and said that everything was fine because he just used too much strength. He even replied that he had frightened her greatly. People started clapping, saying that they were real heroes. And they love them. Young Shi has been watching all this time. And when he saw it ended, he said that he must prepare the news. When he came back and then looked at the side of the monster's corpse, he saw that a small one-eyed killer clown had come out from inside him. Then, after that, the monster saw him and started moving towards him. The man thought that his physical and basic defense was very high. So perhaps mental attacks would be its weak point, said the monster in turn. In his language, he would take revenge on this hero. Spicy Noodles When he found his owner and absorbed enough energy, saw Yang Shi say that he looked appetizing and chose him as his master. Yang Shi in turn calmly said that his ability would now become by activating his ability. He was able to paralyze the clone monster, so the female heroine noticed something and thought that someone used her ability to give the monster away. Yang's eyes said it was good that he was only a weak clone, but even if his weakness was his D-plus rank mental attack, couldn't kill him instantly. And then he started to extract his abilities. Score is a very useful tank ability. And then Yang Shi I started to cover some kind of blue fire vapor, and he thought that the invisible shell covering the surface of his body was that shield. And he said no matter how strong his ability will always be weak. He found this popular phrase in the world, and his ability doesn't seem to work on him, fiery butterfly which is the cry of the heroine girl who has arrived and who is here. But at this time, Yang Shi was able to hide in time and thought that it was not yet time for them to find out about him. The girl landed and said that it was strange because she felt a sharp psychic energy flow here. And seeing someone then, 
A man in a bird mask came out of the shadow instead of him looking for him, turned to his side. He asked if she had used her abilities and she answered positively. Then after that, at this time on a wide road, someone was seen facing the masked man. Then, at the same time, the girl asked if he was also a hero. And he said he doesn't remember that you have seen him before the man gave the one-eyed clone killer movie to his side and said that he is not a hero but just a passerby who helped him clean up. The girl was shocked to see the monster clone, and I thought he could finish off the monster so powerful and dangerous in one isolation. But no hero, he should not use his abilities without permission after apologizing he wanted to leave. But a girl blocked his way, saying that he had used his abilities illegally, and he had to follow her to the association for inspection. However, after that, he cruelly said that he thought he could stop it. The girl was a little confused but calmed down immediately started attacking, saying that his actions were against the law. According to the law, he has the right to take action against him, and the man says that's not the way heroes should act with ordinary people, and grabbing one of the fire butterflies, he squeezes it and says now it's his turn to attack. Seeing this, the girl was very scared and apologized quickly, flew away from there under the mask, was a hero. Young Shi entered his turn, starting to reflect that today's image that of the superhero of spicy noodles. Eating blue is similar to the fact that the hero in the Glacier video seems to be doing the same thing and he convinces himself that he would definitely know the whole truth the night Yang Shi walked home via the subway. As he sat on the subway, he thought that now he should stop collecting abilities and focus on developing a reboot brain. He also needed to look for information about the blue pill while thinking about the man standing at the top. He apologized, and leaving the pad where the backpack was standing, he realized that there was no backpack next to him. He started turning around looking for his backpack, and he realized that the man standing above him could steal his backpack and looked in all directions without seeing it. He wondered how he could disappear since they had not yet reached the station, and he couldn't get far. Could it be that he has the ability to see through and think? Then what about his smell, and he started to activate his sense enhancement ability. When he looked at the others, he saw a man in a suit. He smelled like his backpack. Looking at this, young Shi realized that it wasn't invisibility. It was the ability to change his appearance and green printing. He said that this ability, which by itself came into his hands, was very useful. When the man who stole the backpack went to his house without suspicion and Yang Shi chased after him, the man was in a very good mood, because today he managed to catch Harvest. However, he didn't understand why he felt nervous and turned around and saw Yang Shi waving at him. The man didn't understand how he could understand that it was her and started chasing. Suddenly she started running and he was able to escape from the public toilet chasing her. Yang Shi's eyes sarcastically said that he would really use the middle class trick of hiding in the toilet. When he was too weak to get out of there, there was only silence as my response here in turn. After looking at the toilet, you realize that the man went into the toilet, the woman entered the women's toilet. Then after that, in a toilet, Yang Shi told him to come out and he knew that he was here. However, on the other side of the door, they shouted accusing him of being a pervert, to which Yang Shi kicked the door with her foot. He opened it, and the same turned it into a girl. But not very beautiful, she has started to throw herself with different things. Doubting that there is a pervert here, Young Shi said that her ability is very unusual, because even changed her voice immediately apologized to her. He says that this is the first time he has stolen something. Mata Young in turn adds that unfortunately his abilities cannot change body and appearance after changing my wallet into a backpack. I gave it to my owner. Take out your bag, Yongs. I asked gloomily if he had a look inside, the man stammered, saying that he didn't open it, to which Yang Shi adjusted his glasses and said, that let him find a normal job in the future and be a good person. The man thanked him for his mercy and said that he would not steal again hearing this, Yang Shi said. Did he say that he would save him and by activating his ability? He extracted his disguise ability. Yang Shi said that he promised himself that he would no longer collect abilities but still couldn't resist such temptation. This ability belongs to the F rank ability. Title change. Clothes. Anywhere description can change clothes with one hand movement. The kid also has a storage space and then he uses this ability and his clothes change into a black suit. Young, I think it is a very convenient and useful ability.
In this case, there were two police outside. They asked what they received from one of the residents that someone was shouting at themselves in the women's toilet. Did he hear it? To which Yang Shi said that he had heard and seen one of the perverts. Then after that, those undercover who behaved suspiciously, the police immediately went there, and when I saw them take the guy away, I was a Nazi. And says that some people with abilities do not deserve their own abilities, and he will definitely fix it. A week later, when Gandhi got out of the taxi, he saw Peng's fans who greeted him with a smile. Yang Shi asked him what he really wanted to say. So he called her earlier here, and he put his hand on her shoulder and told her to guess who he just saw at the nightclub. When asked by whom, Fan Ming answered that his girlfriend was Lin. He said he worked there as a maintenance staff member. Yang Shi looks at him in disgust and says that he is not her boyfriend and asks why he is telling her this. But he angrily says that maybe he will stop this pretense in front of her. After all, she will now see it for herself and understand everything when they enter the club. Yang Shi. I saw the girl as a stripper when she was dancing. She saw that I was here and wondered what she was doing here. Gang Zai and his friend Ming fans were sitting on chairs and drinking specially. Then at this time, Yang Shi was sitting with his friend at a club. And suddenly, while he was drinking, he looked into Yang Shi's eyes and smiled. Then he said that he was in his territory today. And so that he could relax, he called three girls to him. His friend introduces them their names. Zai Zai, Tian Tian, and Pao Pao. She said that they were amazing little sisters to her and introduced her friend Yang Shi in front of them. The girls immediately sat next to her and started saying that he was very handsome, the place where nearby there was a man knocking loudly. Alcoholic drinks on the table and said that I was unlucky for him. Today, if his brother hadn't taken his McLaren, he wouldn't have lost to that Gaussian boy. There were two girls sitting next to him. And some more sitting on the other end of the chair, a big guy with red hair, said he lost the race, he couldn't admit it, and don't blame the car for everything. His name is Leanne. The man who complained laughed and said that the same thing in turn couldn't break through to his father's side, and that's why he became his body, and this person is called Lu Yuan. Li Yun asked her bodyguard if it was because she didn't close her mouth properly. Liang replies that it bothers a normal person like him, Liu Yun, to be restricted by such a hero of his rank. The guy from here got angry and hit one of the girls. It was our neighbor, Mata Young Li Yu, and took this alcoholic drink and immediately cruelly told him how dare he forced him to drink this crappy drink and poured the remaining alcohol on his head. Then after that, seeing that Yang Shi also wanted to go to them. But his friend stopped him by saying that he is not acting recklessly. This young man's name is Liu Iwan, and he is the second son of the mechanical hero rank of the Kunlun Company. And this bodyguard is the hero of the Fire Fist rank. But Yang Shi still refused telling him to let him go where his friend said that a normal person like him was not their rival. Yang Shi in turn coldly said that she knew this, and she just wanted to go to the bathroom and left. While in another room, a girl with tears in her eyes sat on the floor, and the guy said if they knew how to apologize and he ordered one of them to finish it, he left, and then he was about to forgive them all. One of the men approached him and began to forcefully pour alcoholic drinks into his mouth. And then suddenly he was kicked so hard that he flew several meters away from the girl who was only wearing our young eyes. Bird mask, he said that he had heard that the son of the mechanical hero was here. The bodyguard asked who he was, and Liu Yu, who was drunk and drinking, said that this is another person who wants to die. Yang Shi says he just wants to make a deal with Liu Yun's brother. He was already very drunk, but still looked at her and asked what kind of deal. Then the bodyguard also said that it was time for them to leave, and it was quite late. Liuan threw him a bottle and told him to close it, because they wanted to make a deal with him and also insult him with a few words. Drunk, and he has to rest now and he adds that he will talk to this actor himself. Yang Shi sat on a chair, casually taking one glass in her hand, saying whether she wanted to attack him, and adding that she was against all violence. But he prevented him from talking about important things with his own master. And now he was just going to teach him a lesson. And the guard got up from his seat, hearing this. He started to activate his ability, saying that it was yet to be seen who would lose. Then at this time a guard was seen with a fire energy in both hands, 
and he told Yang Shi that he was very unlucky today because Yang Shi challenged the wrong person. Then after that, his ability was activated and all his power was in his own hands. It accumulated in his fists like fireballs. Yang Shi thought this was the fire element attack of the other ranks and started to say that he was brave because he dared to challenge the students of the hero rank. Some girls came to Yang Shi's neighbor and helped him get up. Some people present asked why they were fighting. Some said about Mata Yong. Doesn't his mask look like a chicken? And it seems very mysterious. Will he be able to defeat the fiery boxer? The fiery boxer aimed his fist at Yang Shi, but he didn't move a niche, and this made the fiery boxer a little nervous because he had to dodge, but he didn't dodge and thought that it could be some kind of trap. When his fist was almost close to Yang's eyes, he dodged it and sarcastically asked if this was all he had. The bodyguard laughed and said, Since the day he became a hero, no enemy or beast could withstand this attack and send a torrent of fiery power towards him. Everyone was shocked and scared because his power could definitely hurt someone. However, Yang Shi was able to get out of the fiery desert without any harm by dissolving all the flames. The fiery boxer was surprised that Yang's eyes were not injured. Yang Shi raised her hand and attacked him with her mental attack ability because of this. The bodyguard froze and immediately knelt down. Yang Shi approached him and hit him on the neck, and he fell to the ground watching all this. Li Yunstun said that this person was surprisingly strong that even a fiery boxer could overcome with one punch. At the same time, Yang Shi extracted his fiery boxer ability. Included in the ability of the rank name description, fire blow can form flames in the hand rate, the most important thing for a cook. When he finished, he looked at Lun. The bodyguard standing behind him immediately disappeared, as if they weren't there, and he himself started to slide out of the chair from fright and he was angry at how his bodyguard lost to him. But after that, he quickly looked into Yang Shi's eyes. He stuttered and asked what deal he wanted to talk to her about if he needed money. He could transfer as much as he wanted now, but Yang Shi ignored his words and grabbed his neck. And picks him up Li Yu and breathlessly asks if he knows his father Yang Shi says that his father is a mechanical hero, and what is the big deal? Li Yun says that if he kills him, his father will not spare him. After that, he put him on the ground and said that he would not kill him. Then he asks if she knows what she wants to do with it, and he asks if she wants to have some kind of ability. His eyes widened in shock. Yang Shi let go of him, and he fell to the ground due to impotence. Liu Yun said how could he do this? Yang Shi threw a piece of paper and said that if he wants to receive it, he must come to this address on a piece of paper one in seven days already without a mask on his usual clothes. Yang Shi's eyes stood up and called his friend. Then he excitedly asked where he was. Yang Shi said that the bar was very noisy and he went outside to catch his breath and asked what happened. He says that he missed a really good show and she says that she will see him now. Yang Shi in turn thought that part one of his plan was complete now, just waiting for Liu Yuan to bite the hook and if he started checking from within the heroes of Kunlun Company, it would be faster. The painting moves to Kunlan Bear Hero Building. Some people watch a video where a masked man hits a fiery boxer with one hand and knocks him out. Then when the video ends, the gray-haired man asks what everyone thinks about this. He is the hero mechanic hero. Glacier Adventurer says that the masked man used his hands like knives to handle the fiery boxer in one second. And in his opinion, he was most likely of a higher rank and the lazy swordsman hero said that this was not what killed the fiery boxer. He lost the moment the masked man made a movement with his hand. Another man with horns named Molung threw a folder at them and said that this was the assessment of the fiery boxer who was injured. From the identification department, and they had to look at it all after seeing the documents were very shocked because the fiery boxer's ability was gone. And it looks like they are facing a big problem. CP10. Then, while still in the association, he was associated. The swordsman said where this guy came from. And how could he take another person's ability? Mo Long said that as far as he knows, only S-rank heroes can have such ability. Then the mechanical hero looked at him and asked him if he was thinking about the person he himself was thinking about, who the Glacier Adventure hero jumped over. 
his chair, and said that this was impossible because the carrier was an old man who already had one foot in the grave and there was no way he could show up now. Molong said that the Kunlun Company couldn't handle this matter themselves. They should report this to the Heroes Association. The lazy swordsman hero said that a special ability holder like him, regardless of which company he turned out to be, would be used as a killing machine. And no one will report him as a mechanical hero. After thinking about it, it suggested that they don't tell them about it first. It would be their own company secret. And the meeting was over. Then after that, at Liu's house, Yuan lying on the sofa, Liu Yuan wondered if he could get at least one ability, took out a piece of paper, and looked at the address he said that the man said that this was a deal. But what did he need from her? However, he grinned. He said that it didn't matter, and in a few days, he would have the ability, and he didn't care about the rest. Yang Shi and her friend Fan Meng came to the Luga City Museum. When asked by Fan Ming why he invited him to the museum, he said that he wanted to learn more about monsters, so it would be easier for him to escape if he encountered them. But in his mind was whether he could extract the monster's ability from the ring when they entered the museum. They saw some beautiful girls. After seeing this fan, Ming said that he didn't think he was trying to learn about monsters about picking girls. Girl, everyone knows that only beauties come here. Yang Shi annoyed pointed at one of the monsters and said, She came here for this. This monster is called Electric Tyrannosaurus, a monster with a rank of 7 meters high, 12 meters long. The monster that appeared in the early stage was spit out electricity and caused many disasters that caused the entire city to be paralyzed. Because of him, Favera rank hero died 13 B rank hero and 27 degrees Celsius rank hero. Young AI says that he is planning to write an article about the monster invasion. Seeing this monster turns in awe and with fear says that this monster is very strong. And he thinks to himself what will happen next. If he can extract this terrible ability, I want to touch it. But then the guard shouted to them, what are they doing here? Yang Shi greeted him and handed him his ID card. After looking at the guard, he said that if he wants to write an article, then you can only look with your eyes here and not touch his hand with the corner of your eye looking at him, a friend who understands. He nodded to distract the guard, taking him away from Yang's questioning eyes. Does he know where the most beautiful girls are here, which according to the guard he asked crazy, which made Fan Ming smile and say, that they are so special and rare I activated them all myself. And in ability extraction I extended my hand to the monster but he thought that his ability was difficult to extract, although he felt his abilities when the extraction was complete. He looked at the ability ranking plate, but there was nothing there, even though he was surrounded by the aura of the monster's ability power. Then, after that, an ability board appeared in front of him, and that is the appearance of an E-rank skill, and from its ability, it can create plasma, and it can also be used to charge cell phones. Yang Shi was very surprised because he only took out the E-rank ability of a C-rank monster. In his hand, he held a small lilac ball of abilities Yang Shi thought was probably because this monster had been dead for a long time, and its abilities had disappeared as well as weakened. Could it be that the last time he was able to extract abilities from the monster was because the monster was still alive? And we are shown a flashback of how he extracted the abilities from the one-eyed killer clone and I realized that it looked like he wasn't going to get anything sensible from the museum. But there was no way he had come here in vain. He had to keep looking to arrive at his apartment. Yang Shi was sitting in his room. There were three ability orbs on the table. He could only get three low-rank abilities by going around the entire museum. One of them is an F-rank ability called Clone Description, can be used to create a clone that exists for one minute. The score can be used to turn on the lights. Other abilities are also included in the F-rank title. Human control description can make anyone show interest in it. On evaluation asked that he definitely would not use it to perform unethical actions. Well, the last ability was taken from the monster. Electricity. I'm not saying that the power of this ability is so weak that it scares him because abilities can be combined. Can they also be destroyed? And he wants to try to do it with his fire ability after a while of trying he was still able to crush the ball. This ability and a dark cube appears on the table in front of him. 
The table says level one pair of dark energy descriptions. Based on the ranking of perfect and indestructible substances, the box takes one of them. Yang Shi wondered if that could happen. And the ability created from these cubes is that he can actually destroy the ability by taking all these cubes. However, Yang Shi thinks that his abilities can be broken down into the most basic components, namely dark energy cubes, so he can respectively use these dark energy cubes to improve his abilities. And he combined the abilities of Fireboxer and Dark Cube. Indeed, his abilities have increased now. This ability is part of the rank's name. The description of human control, he can mentally get closer to the goal of assessing the ability to deceive people. And now he could start engaging in deception. Yang Shi was surprised that he could do this. And after looking at the rest of the cube, he thought that now he would be able to create abilities of his own rank. And then a scream was heard outside, someone shouting not to touch him. Young Eleven thought that Liu Yuan had come to Lin Nixu. Then after that, Lin's parents were seen sitting on the sofa, and he himself was crying. His father said that he could only cry. However, he did not intentionally try to trick her. Otherwise, he wouldn't send them money. And mom also said that his brother needed money to buy a house and a car. And also, getting a wife the total amounted to a million dollars, and adding where they could get it from the girl who was clenching her fists said that they had been cheating him all the time, saying that his father was seriously ill and he needed to send money immediately, and crying he said they imagined how desperate he was. When he found out that his father was sick, he worked for a chef from morning till night just to earn money as quickly as possible. However, perhaps the father nonchalantly said that they were thinking about it. At first, just send as much money as he could and he would find a way to get the rest later. Their Lin family's bloodline cannot end with them. The girl would take it all, saying it was just a way to take it home and sell it to a guy she didn't even know. His mother held his hand and said that even though this man did not have a higher education, he was honest and kind, he would not molest the girl. At the grain said with his own hands at least they could imagine where the 50,000 he had sent a week ago had come from. This is that he is a bartender, and heavy staff heard this. The parents were very shocked because they did not expect this. Dad angrily said how he dared to ruin their family's reputation and wanted to hit him, but he was stopped by Yang Shi. He said we could discuss everything calmly, because she was still his daughter. Seeing Yang Shi, she cruelly said who she was to interfere in the family business. But after that, he punished his daughter for what she had done and who was she to stop it, and thought that her father didn't regret it at all. But his mother seemed to feel bad and regretted everything that happened, and I decided that I would do it. Help him a little and see if he can help Lin Nakesu, and he activates his ability to control someone with rank. And then she told her husband to say that his daughter even became a girl in easy behavior because of him, because he was completely heartless, and hugged his daughter. He apologized and encouraged him. The father sighed and said that then his brother would get everything himself. I just think it's good as long as people understand it all the time and who in the world wouldn't feel sorry for their own family. And he remembers about his sister. The next morning at the train station, the girl waved her hand in forgiveness and told her parents to be careful on the way home and said, he will come to them for the new year. His mother bid him farewell, telling him to be careful and not do anything stupid again. The girl looked at Yang Shi and thanked him for seeing her off. Yang Shi said she hoped her brother would understand this, and that it would be much more useful than any amount of money he would send home. That girl who blushed a little told him to come a little closer. When he came closer, she kissed him on the cheek and thanked him again. Then after that, in the evening, Yang Shi came to a building with his mask. He thought that it should be a high-rank corpse processing center. Very powerful monsters. A large number of monster corpses are stored in this place, and this can make it easier to gain new abilities. And as he hid in the shadows, a truck passed him, and he still thought that it looked like he could just choose a special way to get inside. And it was a truck that he unknowingly jumped onto the truck and held onto it from the side. And just he wanted to breathe a sigh of relief. Then to his surprise, a red-haired girl appeared in front. About him, he wanted to say something, but he silenced him. And then we have a photo of him almost squeezing her into the truck. 
while he held the handle and then realized that this girl is also trying to get into the middle. The man greets him and says what a coincidence it is, and then he sheepishly shouted that it was no coincidence, and he was very unlucky. So he met him and he said that now they will act according to the rules of the field and rely on their abilities, and introduced himself as a representative of the chamber. Trade Fang Hai Tan Qian Duo Duo, and he asked who she was, she only said another name, introducing herself as Yu Jai. He said that they would soon reach the loading and unloading area, and said that he wouldn't be able to get off the truck while they were standing like this and still holding him, I would immediately jump from the truck to the ground. They rolled and fell to the ground. I asked Nancy how long she was going to hold her like this. The girl blushed from the displacement and suddenly stands up angrily, saying that if the situation doesn't require it, who would even want to hug him? They both enter the Monster Corpse processing room, and the girl asks why he looks like he has never seen anything like this. Maybe he is new to this business. Yang Shi replied that yes, she was new and would be under his supervision. And then they went into a room there was a monster that looked like a snowman lying there. The girl said that her boss needed the white hair on the werewolf's chest and would have to cut it carefully. He cuts it off and takes out some kind of wallet, giggling. He says that its ability is, this storage can hold a lot of things young. He thought it was an embarrassing name for a cosmic ability, and he turned around and said that now they should go to the next investigation room. While Yang Shi was already able to extract the monster's ability, it was a D-rank ability name. Metal transformation description can change the appearance of any metal evaluation is a dream, one of the car service owners. Then the alarm went off. Suddenly both of them were shocked by the shock. Then a man came into the room screaming, that the monster is not dead. Then at this time Yang Shi was seen with him. However, at the same time the girl suddenly said that her legs were numb, and he asked Yang Shi to hold him for a moment. However, suddenly he was caught by the monster's tentacles and dragged out of the room. Out of fear, the girl almost couldn't hold herself back and asked Yang Shi to save her. But then suddenly he too was caught by the monster's tentacles and he started to pull away. Yang Shi activated his power fire ability and restrained him from running after the tentacles. He thought that these tentacles were very fast. And after looking everywhere, he realized that they were all metal shelves and he activated the D-rank metal transformation ability. But after that, the metal turned as if into a sharp blade and cut the tentacles into several pieces. He asked if he was okay. He still sits on the ground and says that there is a hook in this tent and it hurts. And seeing this tentacle, he asks what kind of monster he said, that they would find out. After they looked, and then the monster itself appeared in front of them, where instead of a head there was a human skull and many tentacles coming out of it. He had managed to catch several people, they were all screaming for help. And then the monster noticed them and sent them its tentacles. Yang Shi used his metal transformation ability to create a shield, but not being able to stand it for long became smaller and smaller. Seeing this, the girl started screaming and panicking that she would now die and be eaten. Yang Shi realized that this couldn't continue, and thought that it seemed like he had just seen several cans of petrol. Yang Shi asked the girl not to be afraid, and he had the idea of throwing several cans of petrol at the monster. He aimed his fireball at them, and they exploded, and everyone started running towards the exit. While the young eye girl was chasing them, tentacles were chasing them, and just wanted to catch the girl. Then someone cut him in half. It was a menacing-looking man and asked if they were thieves who revived monsters to attack this place. After hearing that statement, the girl viciously started screaming, saying who he was. And why had he just appeared and was already bringing nonsense? The old man glared angrily and said that he was being impolite, and when he was young, he was still one of those who still drank milk. The girl was even more angry and shouted that he was being rude as a parent. Yang Shi recognized him, and he was definitely the hero who defeated King Kong Rampage ten years ago. And after fencing the girl, he nodded his head and welcomed her. Acknowledging his respect, the old man turned towards the monsters and said that he would deal with them. After he finished dealing with that monster, Yang Shi thought this was an old man of hero rank. What was he doing here? Then, after that, he drew his sword. The hero jumped at the monster that attacked him with his ability. The name of the attack was Yang Shi's Polar Star Attack Style. 
The greedy wolf attacks and a wolf silhouette comes out of the sword and cuts the monster's tentacles into pieces. Watching all this, Yang Shi said what was expected from the legendary inherited powers called North Star Attacks were each advanced techniques that even ranked ability holders had to take a few steps back. The girl said in admiration that it was so cool the monster growled menacingly and began to attack the hero with all its tentacles. He once again attacked the North Star, but now his style was too deep. Heaven starved, and now the monster was left completely without tentacles. But finally, the heroes turned their swords and attacked with their heaven water abilities and plunged the blade into its head, and I was able to defeat this terrible monster immediately. After he dealt with these monsters, he landed on the ground and said that now it was his turn to deal with them, namely young and girl's eyes. Yang Shi thought how intensely his eyes were filled with determination and killing intent. He said that they really weren't the ones who brought this beast back to life. And Du Senior and not wanting to believe it says that it's all bullshit and says that he doesn't believe it. Because they have suspicious personalities. The girl turned to Yang Shi saying that if he had confidence that he could defeat this old man. Yang Shi said she couldn't. But did she want to, to which the girl answered in the negative and said she just wanted to. Let him borrow a weapon and give him armor made from monster materials at that rank. He said that he was sure she would help him and he would support her. And then the elder attacked him, but Yang Shi was able to dodge it. He thought that this armor could withstand his attacks because he was really very strong. The old man started to attack from different sides. But Yang Shi was able to withstand the blow and he started to use his brain reset. Because of this senior's deeds, it started to attack more slowly. Ian noticed it, but realized that it was not enough to defeat him. And then he used his human control ability, and then the old deed froze and couldn't attack Yang's eyes. He shouted that he stopped his movements, and Yang Shi replied that he would be in danger if he didn't do it. The hero shouted, saying, Is this all the trick is capable of doing by petty thieves like him? Yang Shi uses his metal transformation ability to create his sword and attacks Doom. Yang Shi notes that each blow of his prayer is powerful. He can use one's control to stop it for a short time. And so that he himself is not cut into two parts. Sixth Zone Rank Weapon God, because he could fight and chill Yang Shi, was confused to understand who the weapon god was. But after that, humans said that judging from Yang Shi's attack, he most likely wasn't a thief who put down his sword. He ordered everyone to leave this corpse processing area because he had something to say to him, which made the staff a little hesitant. But when they saw his angry expression, they immediately ran out, and the girl said she would wait for him outside. Yang Shi asked what he wanted to tell him, to which the council said he knew that Yang Shi was not a gun god. His skills couldn't compare to a weapon god, only his metal skills were similar to his and he added that even so, he had some abilities, and therefore he could be considered strong, someone like that would never come here just to steal some furs. And I asked him to say whether he came here to seek the secrets of the world. Yang Shi was even more confused about what the secret of the world was talking about. However, he decided that he would find out more information from her. And he answered this question positively. Duman laughed and said that it would be good for a young and strong man like him to tell it. And he said that the real purpose of building this center was to open a one-way tunnel to the monster world that is open a white hole. Yang Shi was very surprised by this statement, and I remembered what happened 15 years ago. 15 years ago, people managed to open a white hole in the city of Lugansk that the Heroes Association has sent a small team of high-ranking heroes with a special mission to penetrate the world of monsters. Because they risked their lives, and he said that, actually every monster corpse processing center is built in the weakest point on Earth. As long as they keep burning the monster bodies in this weak point, they can open a white hole that leads to the world. Monsters. Yang Shi asked, what about the living monsters? Dune said that this was something they didn't tell the outside world. In fact, this was a mutation that rubbed against the white hole. The people on this planet are like animals trapped by animals. Only when they gather the strongest forces of humanity, they will have a chance to defeat them. Turning around, he walked away and finally said that he could leave, and it didn't matter what organization he stood for. 
but they must remember that they are part of humanity. Then in a tall building, you can see a man sitting in a chair with a beautiful girl standing next to him, and at that time they were talking while looking at a view of the city from a glass. Then after that, the woman angrily said that what the old man did to Shula was stupid. How could he say such things to the outside world? And the man sitting in the chair said that even if he didn't tell it sooner or later, the other organizations would find out. And it was impossible to keep the world's secrets just between them. The woman turned around and organized a video conference from the headquarters here, and a woman from the video broadcast said that more than 25 people took part in it, and they have met all the necessary requirements to consider Category C cases further. They started a conference about what the Lugansk City Heroes Association reported if they told the truth to the Hero Owners Association, which went beyond a moving picture rating to our hero Yang Shi, who visited his sister and sat with her in the ward. He was still unconscious sitting next to Yang Xinya, starting to say that he had learned one harsh truth today. And we were moved by the time he left the Corpse Processing Center building. The people had gathered quite a lot by now, and everyone was wondering what was going on inside. And did Yang Shi win, or why was he the only one who came out? The girl named Qian Duo Duo came to Yang Shi and asked if he was all right. If he thought he couldn't tell others about his ability to say that everything was all right, he asked him to, to look into his eyes. When he saw, he activated his ability to control that person, and he started to suggest to him. That the bather had forgotten that he had used fire and metal abilities, and he remembered that he had brought him this armor. And plus, he owed him ten thousand, and when he snapped his fingers, he immediately shuddered and ran off saying it was good that he was fine. But he already has a curfew at home, so he will go one. Yang Shi said that this Tandoto is very similar to Fei Fei. He is cute and likes money stroking his hair. He says that after he gets his revenge, he will find a way to wake him up. At night, in his room, he sits in front of the table, activating his metal transformation ability and turning a small metal into a ring. It was a star-absorbing ring, and there was an ability medicine inside the bottle. Yang Shi said that he couldn't let people know his true abilities, and therefore he had to use these two things to deceive the human Lu and recreate his mask. However, and at the same time, he completely changed his clothes by calling this set of clothes Snake, his ability will be different from Big Eyes. However, he will give we our electric rank, he can also use fire attacks when necessary. Due to the fact that Yuji became part of this organization that often happened on its own, and that would be called the judge's main goal. Yang Shi is to assess the heroes who have fallen in the organization's expenses will be decided by young master Liu. Then at this time, we saw Yang Shi now wearing a big eye mask, heading towards a building. He was supposed to meet someone. However, when Yang Shi arrived, he saw him sleeping on the floor. Seeing Yang Shi, he kicked him and told him to get up. She jumped up from her seat and wanted to say that how dare he treat her like that. But when he saw Yang Shi was quiet and apologized for falling asleep, Yang Shi thanked him for coming and said that it looked like he really believed her. He left you in, throwing him on his knees, began to beg Mata Yong to give him the ability and in return. He can get whatever he wants, at least girl money or status. Yang Shi pushed him away and said that she was not interested in everything he signed up for. And he said that getting the ability was easy. He just had to look into Yong's eyes when he looked at Yong's eyes, using his new male control, and ordered him to tell him everything he knew about the blue pill. But the man with indifferent eyes just looked at him and was silent. Yang Shi wondered why it didn't work and ordered him to slap himself. But he was still sitting quietly looking at her. He thought that maybe she already had some kind of ability. Could it be that the ability to grow from rank could withstand human control? And with a mental attack, he deactivated it and started analyzing the last time. Li Yuan didn't attack him at the bar, and it seemed like he didn't have the ability. But still, I tried to extract abilities from him. And the abilities that actually came out of him really surprised Yang Shi. The ability is part of the rebirth description of a rank ability group title only once. After death, he can be reborn and return for a day of judgment. Even though it's not a ranked ability, it can just be used. 
After death, how stupid Yang Shi would be, that Li Yun could have the ability. But still taking his abilities for himself, he kindly invested them with pearls he received at the Monster Processing Center. When Yang Shi gave him the order to get up, he suddenly jumped up from his seat and asked when she managed to fall asleep. Yang Shi said that everything was fine and showed him. This ring is a star-absorbing ring made by the organization, and he can use it to steal other people's ability factors. Li Yu, and asked in surprise if it was really possible to do such a thing, gave him a bottle of liquid. He said that the organization uses these factors to turn them into healing abilities that can give ordinary people the ability to drink them. He said it had to be something special. And was he cheating? He Yang Shi said that he could try and find out whether it was true or not in his mind. Li Yuan thought what if it was poison, but if he wanted to kill him? He wasn't going to delay until today, and after making up his mind he took it anyway. After he took the medicine, his eyes immediately started to redden, and he started to choke. Yang Shi grinned angrily and said that he would soon find out the power of his abilities. However, at this moment, his body suddenly seemed to change into that of a half-wolf, and at the same time, his whole body became very hot. Then after that, Yang Shi thought that it really had nothing to do with the drug. He controlled the curl ability from a distance, and after a few seconds, he completely turned into a gray werewolf. Li Yun looked at himself and asked. Yang Shi said his transformation ability and asked what he thought was still learning himself leaving you, and said that his brother could turn into a dragon. And he asked the question whether he was stronger than his brother or weaker. Yang Shi said that his brother had no ranking ability, and he only has E rank. And Liu Yuan angrily says that there is a three rank difference between Ranka and E Young, is a little offended, and tells her not to worry because he just joined the organization, and therefore they could only give him F rank medicine for now. They will work together now, he changed the medicine to E rank for him. Li Yun thinks that based on this they have abilities in the organization and are meaningless that one day he might become stronger than his father, and suddenly falling to his knees he hugged Yang Shi and asked to call her. Father, if he could turn it into a rank for him. Yang Shi's eyes angrily said that there was no need to call him father, pushing him away. But leave you and the mentor with his own words, and he will call him. After all, he had never received such kindness from anyone in his life, to which Yang Shi said that she didn't have it even if she were to call him. The organization has its own rules, and he should get it only when he makes enough achievements sitting behind it. Dog-like legs with burning eyes asked what kind of organization they were. Yang Shi said that the name of their organization was Hakim, and it was made by one strong person. There are twelve Zodiac leaders under the boss, and he is the rooster of the twelve Zodiacs. Liu An asked such a powerful person like the Godfather, just the head, how strong the boss of the organization himself was. Yang Shi said, don't try to please him. The boss is not a person who often shows his face. He was very mysterious, and Liu Yuan, with a twinkle in his eye, asked him what he should do to raise his level quickly. Yang Shi said that through fulfilling the tasks given by the organization, and he only had tasks for him, and said that Liu Yuan should use his young title. Master at the Kunlung Company to look for information about the blue pill. And when Li Yuan asked what it was, he said it looked like a pill that could increase one's strength. Yang Shi said that he came to Lugenza to find out about the power behind this thing, hearing this Liwan ask in awe whether it could really increase one's strength. If so, then the extremely awesome Yang Shi hit him on the head, telling him not to harbor such evil ideas. Due to the fact that a hero used these pills that innocent people suffered, after regaining his appearance, he misses his bruised spot and asks who is the person who has hurt an innocent person. Yang Shi said that this was the hero rank of their company. Glacier adventurer Li Yuan was surprised because Lycanians were glacial adventurers who always behaved coolly. But actually, he turned out to be a drug addict. Yang Shi said when he found useful information, they would meet here again, and then he would give him a D-rank ability. And he also added that the effects of the drug only lasted for a week, and therefore must bring the information within a week of this statement. Li Yuan was very surprised. Then after that, on the other side, 
you can see Yang Shi walking in the middle of a city. He saw a poster stuck to the wall of the city. After it was discovered, the contents of the poster stated that a person with his own name was being sought. They depict him in a black raincoat and with a white mask on his face. And if someone finds such, then they can call the owner's number below it. And that is Qian Duo Duo. Seeing that Yang Shi was spitting on the wall with the coke he had drunk. Seeing this, the shop owner shouted at him to take this statement with him. He said that he didn't think that this girl had anything similar up her sleeves. But then he saw Qian Duo Duo coming to the alley with some people, and he started to pay attention to them. After seeing these people, he asked who they were. There were two men and a woman standing in front of him. One of the men says it is better to listen and gives them young master Qian Duo's sword. Duo angrily says that he doesn't know what sword he is talking about. She didn't even have one where the guys screamed that she wasn't cheating. After all, he played with their young master because he was too naive, and he used his fake jewelry instead of his sword. And it was better to give him a sword if he wanted to live. Realized that it was the Kurama sword, and this sword was a legendary S-rank weapon. Do Kai and Qian Duo Duo really have it? He thought that this sword was really a very good thing to hide his bag behind his back. He calmly says what kind of man they are talking about he doesn't know about this. Maybe they were wrong. Yang Shi looked at them meaningfully and thought that this quarrel was very bad. Love can conclude as soon as he hears that this greedy girl has received a sword, but don't want to give it. The unknown girl says that there is no need for this chat and says that they will continue the action, and the guy attacks her using his army-style abilities and the other three blades in the mask attacked him shadow-style doppelganger Yang Shi, said that these were inherited-type ability holders, and they were both above C rank. And then Kai and Qian Duo Duo took out his fan from his bag and shouted that he is not easy to intimidate, and this weapon is in Kamatachi rank because of the power of the wind flow. They flew several meters away, flying with the help of the fan. He laughed and said that no one could force his goods. After he received it, the girl who was watching activated her array without any female ability and changed her image. Kai and Qian Duo Duo were surprised how much it snowed in such weather. Yang Shi saw this and changed her clothes using the ability to change clothes. A snow woman chasing Qian Duo Duo attacked him with the help of a snow cyclone. Then, after seeing that, Yang Shi shouted his name. But after that, everyone gathered outside to watch the fight and the reporter pointed at it, and he said that there was a fight on Zhang Qin's street, and ask if there are heroes somewhere nearby, then let them come to the rescue as soon as possible. Qian Duo Duo hit the ground hard within the cyclone. The snow woman standing above him asked, now, whether he wants to return an item that did not originally belong to him. But Qian Duo Duo asked mockingly while taking out two small blades from her bag, which one was her silver or gold. This made the girl very angry, and she froze. Qian Duo Duo to his ankles, and he smugly says it's better for him to be honest and give her the sword. Otherwise, he would tear his frozen leg into pieces, taking the knife in his hand. He says that he will never give up on his tricks, and he honestly got it thanks to his skills, and throws the sword towards Yu Jai, that his Mata Young shouts that now the sword is his, and is truly free, and takes the sword. Then after that, Yang Shi thanked him for that. But when he took the sword out of the box, he saw the rusty sword, and he shouted that no one needed the worn sword. Even if they offered him money, Kai and Qian Duo Duo said that he himself didn't know why these people were after him for this sword. The snow woman shouts that they are allies to catch them, and all the ninjas started attacking him using shuriken, and then the sword began to shine with purple light. Yang Shi realized that this sword was absorbing his mental power, and his body began to move on its own because of the sword. And he started to fight them. This greatly surprised the ninja, and the others wanted to attack from behind. But he dodged the sword attack and activated the power of the Murasama sword. The entire path glowed with purple sword flames that the attacker had asked the teacher to save him. At that time, Yang Shi had extracted his abilities from him. He is C-Rank Ability Title 3 Styles, Sun and Moon Knife Description, 3. 
Knife style allows you to activate the power of the knife to fight enemies who attack with the ranket still holding the knife in his mouth. That, and it doesn't seem cool. Yang Shi realized that this sword absorbed too much mental power, and then the snow woman began to attack him. Then after that, Yang Shi said that it seemed like he would have to use the rebirth ability today. But then a green light appeared from somewhere and was able to break all the ice that was flying towards everyone. But after that, they were surprised about what it was. Yang, but they were bold enough to sow chaos in the women's first territory. Snow says that they are here to return what is theirs and adds that they abused their power. And then Qian Duo Duo shouted angrily, saying that it was all because their master gave her the sword. This sword was hers. The snow lady looked at her and thought that a two-ranked hero had arrived, and he had no chance of winning. He first had to ensure his own safety and sent a stream of ice at Qian Duo Duo while looking at Mo. He said that even if they killed their people, if they returned to them what was originally theirs, he would abandon it. Lugansk City and save this girl's life. Mo gave a long chuckle and said that no one said that he could leave Luka City. And he added that he thinks that the first region is a place where you can come and go as you please. The girl glared angrily, already turning to their ice swordsman. He says that this girl is his, and he will go to check UTS abilities. Lazy Swordsman says that the company intends to get her for himself, and advises him not to overdo it. Mo had long attacked Yu Jai. Namely, Yang Shi said that he would not do it because he was only helping his brother solve the problem between them. They said he wanted to hit him with his fists, but Yang Shi was able to block his blow with a knife. But due to the force of the blow, he flew several meters away. Qian Duo Duo shouted his name out of fear. The help of his blow to repel the strong wind was able to eliminate them. And at the same time, the ice lady herself, the lazy swordsman, said that she didn't hit him, to which Qian Duo Duo asked if he didn't just hit. But he said it was just an illusion. He ran away, but he still had to be somewhere nearby. And Qian Duo Duo looked around and shouted, where was his brother? Currently, he was hiding behind the wall, sitting on the ground. He was very tired and thought that the sword had not left a drop of strength in his body. However, he did not understand how he could overcome this threat now. But then he came up with the idea that if this was a weapon from a monster, then he could extract abilities from it. When he extracts his ability from the weapon, he can gain 250 units of dark energy sitting on his chair. Then at that time, Yang Shi was sitting with many small cubes in front of him. And suddenly he thought that even though he couldn't extract the Pearl of Ability, but he didn't expect that I would get so many of these dark cubes. However, it would be nice if it was like that, because this sword was from an S-rank monster. But after that, Yang Shi asked what abilities he had to improve to be able to fight the dragon. And then a sign appeared in front of him, where it was written D rank ability assessment and metal title transformation. Yang Shi tried this ability when he merged the dark cube. And the ability and ability ranking appears the title metal control ability description. It is possible to control all metal within a radius of 1,000 meters. The maximum weight of a controlled metal is a 1,000 ton rating. It's written there. Now he might be an Iron Man after finding out about his ability to swallow it. Then Yang Xi, I said that he felt every object made of concrete and metal the car flew off the building. Finally, he had a chance to fight with who you usually are, and then suddenly the snow woman again sent him a stream of ice cyclones. But Yang Xi, without even looking to his side, was able to block his blow, creating a kind of sword from his strength. Then after that, the girl fell down and didn't understand how this was possible. Yang Xi used his power to hold her down and started extracting abilities from her. Her abilities include title ability rank description, Snow Woman summons Snow Woman to help in battle, and a person can also choose to merge with the god who enters his body. Yang Shi said that he thought it was just a basic ability, but he didn't know that it was this type of calling that was literally the ultimate dream of all men. And then the girl regained her usual appearance and fell into Yang's eyes. When he put it on the ground, Mo Long and the lazy swordsman arrived. Mo Long asked with a grin that he knocked down this passerby. The lazy swordsman thought that his aura had changed to an anti one, saying that he was not a passerby. She wasn't a woman, but she had dealt with her Mo Long, 
and with dignity shouted how he could defeat the snow woman. Yang Shi calmly replied that they could fight him to be sure and asked which of them would attack first or both of them would attack him simultaneously.